have no financial interest regarding this video. PRK is a wonderful surgery with many advantages. So why did it go out of vogue? Was it due to the problem of post-operative haze? In the survey we did, most doctors were against doing PRK due to the post-operative pain. So we thought, what if we could reduce this pain? Would this procedure be more acceptable? We did a quick search on Google for commercially available painkillers and found a preservative-free option of Ketorelac called Acuvail. We use these drugs topically after surgery and noticed that the Wong-Baker pain scale changed from 8 with no analgesic drops to 6. This decrease in pain was not enough. So we wondered if we could perhaps prolong the action of Acuvail by using it in a depot form. Topical drops would wash out of the eye within minutes, but the depot would maintain the concentration of the drug for longer. To begin with, the bandage contact lens packet was cleaned with alcohol. We then waited for 5 minutes. 0.2 ml of Acuvail was injected into the BCL package. The bandage contact lens was then allowed to soak in Acuvail for 20 minutes, following which it was placed on the eye after PRK surgery. The Wong Baker pain scale this time decreased from 8 to 2. We had many questions in our minds about the ideal time for BCL soakage and the period of time the drug would continue to be released from the contact lens in therapeutic concentrations. So we performed an experiment where the Acuvail soaked bandage contact lens was placed in an Eppendorf tube and then transported to the laboratory. The contact lens was then subjected to high performance liquid chromatography which helped analyze the concentration of Acuvail at various time points. This chromatogram depicts the concentration of Acuvail at different time points and it can also be seen that the drug reaches its peak in one hour and it maintains that concentration over the six hours tested. To answer the question of why to clean the bandage contact lens surface, we did a laboratory experiment where we took a swab from the alcohol cleaned bandage contact lens surface and the unclean surface and cultured the same. We found that there was growth seen in the uncleaned surface. We did a study which included 70 patients divided into two treatment arms and the use of the Wong Baker pain scale. The first treatment arm included thoroughly washing the eye with cold BSS and placing a regular bandage contact lens after PRK. The second treatment arm included washing the eye with cold BSS and placing a BCL soaked in Acuvail over the eye after PRK. We found that in group 1, the Wong Baker pain scale was around 8 and in group 2, it was around 2. Pain after PRK can be a huge challenge, but it can be conquered.